Hi friends and family, welcome back to Mimi's Home and Garden. This morning I thought I'd just share with you some of the fall decorations that I've started putting out. I've worked all summer, every weekend, um, canning and dehydrating and putting up food and I just need a break. I work full time and so on the weekends I really, really worked to um, preserve a lot of food. So. Last couple of weekends, I've decided it's time to, to rest a little bit and to decorate. So I was gonna share with you some of my kitchen decorations and then in another video, I'll move into the living room and then the front porch. So here is my kitchen, my floating shelves. In the top, I have a thankful um, board. My friend and I, um, got together to do these Pinterest projects. And so we painted these boards. Our husband very nicely cut those for us. So here is the thankful board. The top up there, I'm going to get some um, small gourds and pumpkins um, from a local market to fill up that space up there. I brought out my favorite fall cookbooks and I'll sit with a cup of coffee at the counter and pick out some recipes for some stews and some soups. There are my carrots, perfect color for fall. And in the back, I have some red peas dried that I put in a mason jar. These bowls were on clearance from Walmart. I think I paid $5 for um, all of these bowls total. They were on a clearance rack. The Farm Fresh Eggs um, was given to me by a very dear friend from work. The bowl in the middle there was a gift from my sister-in-law who has a nice collection of bowls. Here are the Pink Eyed Peas that I canned this summer and my corn. And in the back I have some dried beans, some colorful dried beans in a jar. These are my Dollar Tree bowls and I have matching mugs. And the Dollar Tree is where I got these pretty ceramic pumpkins. And there is some of my peach jam, which is the perfect color. I pulled out some of my green napkins and my favorite napkin rings, the fall leaves, acorns. I have my diffuser going, full of orange and clove and cinnamon smell. This is a wire basket chicken sitting on top. I keep our snacks in that and I got that on clearance. I found these two soup mugs at a grocery store on an end cap and I thought, oh, that's perfect. That matches my hen. And then on this side, which is pretty much like the opposite side, I have more of my favorite cookbooks for fall. So this is my kitchen counter with my floating shelves. And I'm gonna move around over to the sink area. And I kinda of went antique hunting in my attic, which is packed full of stuff. And I had forgotten about these little Tiffany lamps that I had. So I pulled these out, put them on the counter, one there, and one in this corner. And this was a Dollar Tree find. I just love it, farm fresh. Hand picked pumpkins daily. And in the crock pot, I have a beef stew going. So this is basically, oh, there is my hand towel I made with the grandkids. All five of them. I've got another one due any minute now. Swing around. There is the dining room. And yet one more peek of my shelf. And then I'll show you the other sign my friend Leanne and I worked on. This is a longer and it says give thanks unto the Lord. Let's see if I can get that to show up better. Hey Leanne, we worked on these together as much as we could. Give thanks unto the Lord for he is good. I had just finished my dining room table set up 
and I took my long tablecloth and folded it into a runner for the shorter size. When my kids all come, I put in both leaves and my table opens up very wide. But I love the pumpkins. This was a very simple um, place setting to make centerpiece. I just took a, a charger plate, some Dollar Tree finds, and some anise um, seeds. Filled the Dollar Tree jar up with some potpourri, some cloves, apples, cinnamon sticks. Very inexpensive. The leaves came from the Dollar Tree. So I think it makes my dining room look a lot like fall. So this was just a quick little video to show you my kitchen. Oh, there's some laundry there. It needs to be done. It's not perfect, but I'm still working. It's still very relaxing and I'll move on to the living room in the next video. Thank you for watching. Hope you have a blessed day.